Good evening and peace be upon you all. Thank you for the invitation to participate in your celebrations of Pakistan 74th Independence Day. I take this opportunity to express my great appreciation for the work of the Pakistan Business Professional Council, Abu Dhabi, as well as for the contributions of the Pakistani community to the economic and social development of Abu Dhabi and the United Arab Emirates. I'm deeply honored to be celebrating the historic occasion of Pakistan Independence Day with you tonight. On behalf of your brothers, sisters, and friends in the United Arab Emirates, we send greetings to all the people of your great country. We are confident that the people of Pakistan will continue with great success to uh, pursue their vision of a just, peaceful, and prosperous society. We salute Pakistan's resolve to promote and maintain these important national goals. We celebrate its unwavering dedication to the welfare of the entire population. This is why your Independence Day which remind all of us of these important goals and ideals. It's a day of peace, harmony, happiness, and hope for the future. I am pleased to be part of celebrating it with you here in Abu Dhabi and the United Arab Emirates. We in the United Arab Emirates have always admired our brothers and sisters in Pakistan for their success in building a peaceful and prosperous nation. Our two countries share many common interests and values. Our political, commercial, and educational linkages are deeply rooted in confidence, trust, and brotherhood. The knowledge, talent, energy, and, good, and the goodwill of the many Pakistani citizens who have lived and worked in the UAE have benefited our country and have strengthened our friendship. My dear friends, the celebration of Pakistan's Day of Independence is a good opportunity to reflect on the considerable successes Pakistan has achieved and the vast potential and promise of your great country. I personally follow with great interest and admiration Pakistan's significant economic and social progress. As all of you know, I have come to admire the enterprising and hospitable Pakistani people who are so rightly proud of their country. I know from personal experience that Pakistan is blessed with able, loyal, dedicated human resources. Pakistan has leaders who are dynamic, visionary, and also compassionate and caring. There's a strong national commitment in Pakistan to ensure that its citizens live well and that they have the education and the human development that lets them develop their God-given talents and abilities. There's a clear national commitment in Pakistan to the principles of openness, transparency, mutual trust, and positive and productive connections with the rest of the world. There's also a strong confidence in the future as the country becomes more and more influential worldwide. Today on this auspicious occasion, I express my best wishes to the people of Pakistan for a successful future and state my strong belief that Pakistan will always take its rightful place among the nations 
of the world. Dear friends, let me close by saying once again that Pakistan has had an inspiring and blessed 74 years. Pakistan's continued progress and prosperity, its promotion of creativity and innovation, and its focus on improving living condition for its people command our respect and admiration. The country's success bodies well for the future. I wish all of you, my Pakistani brothers and sisters, friends, and all the great people of Pakistan through you, prosperity and continued well-being now and in the future. I am confident that Pakistan will continue to advance and prosper for the benefit of its people, for the benefit of the region, and for the benefit of the entire world. Happy Independence Day.